going on guys? Today's video we're going to be converting this fluorescent light fixture over to LED here in our shop and here's the bulbs that we're going to be using. They're a SATCO S39914 and the way we'll be hooking it up we'll be going with the double ended and here's the bulbs I would normally use the regular T8 uh, fluorescent light bulb 3500 Calvin I uh, tried replacing the bulbs, but I got a bad ballast, so might as well go back with LED. So, take you through here on the video how to wire it up with uh, removing the ballast and get you some LED lights in here. We'll see the difference. So, I already got the uh, light fixture unplugged, the bulbs are removed. So, we'll get up there, pull the cover off, and we'll take a look, see what we got. Phillips screw right there. And then another one down this end. So we want to go ahead and take out those two screws. All right, we got our two screws out. Now we'll just slowly drop this down. Okay. There's our ballast. That's bad. And here's our tombstones. We got two on this end and two on that end as it's a two bulb light fixture so you see our cord right here coming in so these wire connectors that's our power and we follow that over looks like it goes right into our ballast right here so that's our power in and the blue and yellow feed uh, this end of the fixture and the brown and red come down here and feed that end so it's going to be a little difficult to do on the ceiling but uh, I think we'll we'll be able to take care of it so for starters I'm going to go ahead and cut the wires at the ballast on each side closest to the ballast as I can Okay, now we want to remove our ballast, and it looks like we got a, there's a nut on there, so get a pair of pliers, or see if I can get it with my needle nose without getting off the ladder. Okay, so now what we're going to do, we'll get our wire strippers, we'll strip the hot and neutral. We'll also strip the wires going to these tombstones and the ends of the wires that go on, this, uh, on these tombstones down here. So let me get all these wires stripped and we'll be right back. Now, one other thing I want to mention too, it's pretty important, uh, your tombstones or lamp holders, which are these right here. They make two different types, uh, shunted and non-shunted. If you have a non-shunted, so you get your meter, put it on the continuity setting, which it would beep. So if I touch over here, you hear it beeping. So that means it's a complete circuit. So I got one lead on our one yellow wire, and I got my other lead in my hand. We'll touch the other yellow wire. So if the meter beeps, then we know this is a shunted, which means it's connected. So I'm touching that wire, nothing. So these are non-shunted. And if it would beep, then it would be connected. So depending on what type of bulbs you have, uh, for example, the bulbs I got, which uh, will have power on one end of our fixture, neutral on the other end, then either tombstone will work, whether it's shunted or unshunted. And if you have um, type of bulbs where you got power neutral down the same end, same end of the light fixture, then you need, definitely need to have this style here, the non-shunted tombstones. Otherwise, your breaker is just going to trip. So I just wanted to point that out. So now that we got all the wires stripped back, we'll get ready to hook up the wires. 
Okay, I did the one end just so you have an idea what's going on. So the two tombstones on this end with the blue and yellow wires, I tied them all together and I used the hot wire. So I'll pull this off so you can see it easier. There's our two tombstones coming up, our wires, and there's our hot. Okay, and so these would be the tombstones that will stay down this end. And then our white wire, which is our neutral, that will tie in with the wires from the tombstones on this end. The red wire, and I got the other one here. So let me get all those wires from those two tombstones tied into this neutral, and we get a better picture of what it looks like. Okay, this is what it looks like after everything's wired up and in place. Right now, obviously gravity, that's why our wires are hanging down. But once we get our cover back on, we'll be tucked up inside. So we got our two tombstones down here that our blue and yellow wires are. They're tied into our hot lead, which is the black wire here. And then our white neutral ties into the red and brown wires that go down to these two tombstones for our neutral side. And I just threw a couple little zip ties on here just to tighten up everything a little bit. So now that we got that all wired up, let's get ready to throw our cover back on and put the two screws in. So let me get the cover back on here, throw the screws in, and then we'll get ready to put the bulbs in and test it out. Okay, we got one screw started. on okay now we'll just grab our bulbs and throw them in okay here's our bulbs and as you can see there's our LED strip so that side would be up top So you want that to be up top whenever you lock it in place. So this side here faces down, so your light's directing down towards you. Okay, there we go. All right, let me move the ladder over there by the outlet and we'll test it out. Okay, here we go. All right. Pretty easy uh, upgrade to do. Just make sure you uh, you know what type of tombstones you have and what bulbs you're going to use. That way you have the right uh, tombstones for the right bulbs. So it's pretty easy repair. All right. Well, thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next one.